somebody that's like, I'm just trying to help us. If you would just listen to us and what I need. Healer. Look, somebody's like, I'm trying to heal this situation. Aquarius. Okay? I'm trying to heal you. Pay attention. <laughs> somebody's like, pay attention to what I am doing. Okay? It could be an Aquarius in this mix. I wanted to... Ooh, there go my ear. My ear did this with, um... It was Aries, I think it was. And... I'm so sorry. I'm used to like my ear like feeling something in it or something, but it's like a weird ring like ooh. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, but that's how it feels. It's like it's like ooh. Like, ooh. <laughs> Hope nobody think I'm crazy. Um but I ain't never that was never one of my my little signs. Yeah, I know the nose thing started coming on strongly um uh, when I started doing Tarot. Ear, I was kind of like an ear person, right? Like, you could, but like ringing, no, anyway. Aquarius, <clears throat> or do I want to do Pisces and Libra over? We're gonna do Aquarius. Um, you should know my body now. Let's do bad intentions. Let's do a, 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 a monthly. We did the previews, let's do it. That's my baby saying okay. Let's do a monthly. Do a monthly. For my Aquariuses. don't know me you feel like this person really don't know who you are two 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 you have been sent here as you are being called to check in with balance in your life this could be with friends partners or at work if the energy has felt heavy this can also be a sign that things are about to lighten up i'd be like when am i going to get a new page sometimes sometimes it repeats itself and sometimes it gives me a new page but i take it as this since I know that um, spirit do what they want to do, y'all need to hear it. So if it repeats itself, it's because somebody's not listening. Um, but the energy has been feeling hectic right now for some of you guys. And things are about to lighten up. Thank God. I'm not an Aquarius. But, you know, I feel like you guys need that because you've probably been tired of feeling this way too. I don't know what's going on, but a lot of people have been like stressed. Somebody's also trying to get somebody to realize something or see something keys to the city somebody's like i got the keys to the city i run this okay boss aquarius like this all me <laughs> this me <laughs> what's going on with my aquarius who is this aquarius You might want to look cute. Someone's admiring you. Okay. Spirits are always around you. So spirit is guiding somebody. If somebody didn't believe in spirits, they do now or something. I'm getting someone be. I just got the chills too. Someone beyond is watching you. Spirits are always around. Somebody is like. Oh, I. I'm sorry. Somebody is like. I see this. Some, okay. Somebody's going through like this spiritual like little journey and it's like we're we all go through these little journeys and these moments differently. But I feel like overall we all have like some of the same experiences. We were like we know stuff is real, but then when we, we go through it, we be like, damn, like this is real. Like, yeah, like I don't know, but somebody is seeing like spirit has been guiding somebody through something and somebody is starting to realize like this is just not only, I just got the chills again. This is not only me. I'm getting pushed by different forces, okay? And they're not bad forces. Whoever I'm talking to right now is like good forces. If somebody's starting to see that, they're starting to recognize like the spiritual world and how spiritual things happen. For some of you guys, somebody probably have been scared of it or was working. And I keep feeling like somebody's right here fucking watching me. I don't know why, but I feel like somebody's like right right here by my doorway. It makes me want to go look, but I know... Nobody's right there, okay? Especially ain't nothing. There's nobody. Anyway. Somebody beyond is watching you. I'm sorry. 
but I gotta do this. Because some of you guys have an ancestor, like a mom, a father, an aunt, an uncle, grandma, grandpa. And you ain't been really realizing it, but that's them. They watching you. Somebody has inherited a lot of money or gifts from this person, and they're still guarding and watching over you. Some of you guys, they just want to make sure you're doing the right thing with these funds. I don't know where the fuck that came from, but look cute. All right. Take some time out for yourself. You're doing all right. Somebody's admiring you. Things are going to get better. The energy is about to lighten up. See, but then there's also some deception in the background. For some of you guys, this might be a call to check in with your ego. Ooh, excuse me. Yes, somebody needs to take some time out to check their ego. Ah, ah, ego check. You got it going on. But it's like you may be demanding more of people around you that they can't, you can't do. <laughs> so how you expect them to do it? I'm just saying it only because that's my card that came up. Same two cards right here again. Y'all strong. The spirit is guiding somebody. You ain't really believed in it before, but you're going to believe in it now. You got to do the right thing. You're going to be all right. If somebody's admiring you and watching you, are you watching somebody and admiring them? But as I hop into this reading, please keep in mind that the rose in this reading can be reversed. I could be saying you. It could be them. I could be saying she. It could be a he. Flip-flop the rose according to your situation. You be your own leader of discernment when it comes to this reading. You pick and choose what fits and what does not fit. If a part of this reading does not resonate to your liking, leave it for whoever it does resonate with because it is a general reading. It's not a private reading, so it will not resonate with everybody the same. Take what fits, leave the rest. Try your sun, moon, rising, Venus sign, or any other sign in your birth chart to get a clear understanding of what's going on. If you do not have your birth chart, you can Google free birth charts, okay? And it will be a list of websites and free apps. A good app that I like using is CoStar, C-O-S-T-A-R. And it's free. I don't know if it's still free. <laughs> Y'all gonna have to double check. But I feel like if it's anything, I don't think it's like over and over. I think it's free. And if it is like something that you're paying for, I'm pretty sure it's very, very reasonable. But I don't think it's charging anything. I need to double check. But I don't think it is. I think it was a free app. Anyways, Aquarius. I see that. So somebody don't trust somebody. Somebody like you stay back. Seven of Cups in reverse. It's clear as day. Somebody's heartbroken too. Alright, but I'm going to get something clear and honest. Somebody's heartbroken. Somebody, the attraction that once was there is not there because they could possibly see that there's somebody else in this picture that is drawing in on this person. Okay, pulling on this person. You get what I'm trying to say? What's going on with my Aquariuses for September? This is not even the right deck either. Somebody's been using the wrong methods trying to get at somebody the way that they've been speaking or trying i don't know what's going on with my aquariuses this light burning me up what's going on with my aquariuses the emperor in reverse not the emperor the magician in reverse so somebody's being manipulative or you feel like you don't really have what it takes to get this job done or to manifest this new beginning. King of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, so somebody's money could be going bad. Somebody's having to like save more than other Ten of Swords, the Emperor. Are you guys dealing with somebody that's possessed of control and abusing their power and their authority? It's so crazy because I just did a general reading and the Emperor in Reverse, King of Pentacles in Reverse was all came out. And this is the card that came out too as well. Might want to look cute. Someone's admiring you. So, there's this King of Pentacles, the Emperor in Reverse, that's devastated behind closed doors because they didn't get to manifest this beginning with you. And they may be watching you and seeing that you're about to manifest this new beginning with somebody else okay for some of you guys this could be a business partner there's a man okay there's somebody else that's the emperor in reverse that is upset because they're not going to be able to get this situation manifested with you like they thought 
because they were being manipulative. They had to change their approach. It's like somebody could have got what they wanted if they would have came correct. Ten of Wands, but somebody felt burdened. It's kind of like a fight, like a competition <laughs> on the low, for real, for real. Was this the Magician in Reverse and King of Pentacles in Reverse? And then for some of you guys, again, if there's, there's this person that wants to come towards you, but they feel like they don't have their things together all the way. What's the Magician in Reverse, King of Pentacles in Reverse? Like, they may, they may, like, own things or run something, but their money is not so good. And it happens like that. Like, it may be a bad month, or it may be for real, for real. It may have been a bad year for them. COVID fucked up a lot of shit. Ten of cups and then six of cups. And, uh, da, 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 what is this? So, it's like somebody loves somebody, but the memory they hold with this person is just not good. Somebody's holding on to some bad memories. I'm sorry, my, I'm about to start sweating, y'all. <clears throat> oh, Aquariuses. We got the star. We got King of Swords in reverse. What's going on, Somebody is lying. And it's looking like it's y'all. Only because y'all are the star. It's Aquarius. But with you standing in your energy as well, too, it's also like you're going to be healing over this manipulation. Somebody lying. Bitch, you're going to heal from it. Okay? Give me somebody mentally is going through it. But they gonna, you're going to heal from it. it. Or it could just be Aquarius. You are the ones that's lying. My, cro my cross watchers are like, yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Aquarius and somebody flip flop it, okay? Somebody not telling the truth. Something going on in the family dynamic that's not so good, and that's the reason why somebody is rejecting somebody because they know the memories that they hold with this person is just not good, okay? And somebody knows about those memories as well, too. And I'm gonna keep on moving and grooving. The magician. So somebody needs to manifest this situation the right way. Two of cups in reverse. The empress. Ten of pentacles. So. It's clear as day that somebody is only in it for the finances. Yes they are. So this could even be like this is the. Somebody could have like two different child's mother. Two different child's father. Or this could be two different sides of the family. One family is going broke. One family has money. One person is going broke. One person has money. Somebody is being manipulative because of the money. They are leaving one person alone to go after this person that has the money. But the way that they are coming after this person is very manipulative. They're not telling the truth. They're not telling the whole story on what they really want. It's like somebody's trying to beat around the bush. But somebody already knows what it is. Okay, you're broke. You needed some money, and that's the reason why you're coming back around. It's not because, look, Three of Pentacles, you needed some help. You needed, I'm, I'm looking at it. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Three of Pentacles, you needed some help. So somebody is realizing you need some help. You, It's like somebody is like acting like they're trying to do the right thing, but deep down inside, they're trying to do the right thing to get something up out of it. They're hoping for, page of wine, somebody childish. They're hoping for a small little, a cookie. The stroke on the stick. If y'all get what I'm trying to say. A small little gesture. Uh, y'all get what I'm trying to say. Okay. Let's clarify this. What is the magician in reverse? King of Pentacles in reverse? Eight of Cups. And that's why somebody got to walk away. Because somebody is seeing through this. Okay. Somebody's seeing through it. You don't really want to spend time. You don't really want to. Dun dun. You don't really want to spend time. You really are not trying to make it right. You're really just being manipulative. You really just need some money because you're going broke. Okay. Yeah. The Ace of Cups in reverse. This was a missed opportunity. And this person needs to see that. Or realize that. They're actually exhausting you and draining you. Of your energy and your essence. Somebody feels like they're over love because of whatever this is that's happened in the past with this person or this family dynamic. Seven of Wands in reverse. Yeah. It could even been the father figure of this husband which just did not defend you or take up for you the right way. See, you and this nine of pentacles energy. So you're already independent and single on your own. So you already have, like, when, when people are independent, they look, they're, they, bleh. 
they are perceived as being strong, right? Because you're independent. You're on your own. But you've been wanting somebody and craving somebody. But at the same time, it's like the people that you crave and you want, they know that you've been craving and wanting somebody. So they've been playing off of that, right? They've been coming with all type of, you need something to take care of, you can take care of me. That's what this is. <laughs> right? Not like, I'm going to scratch your back and you're going to scratch my back. You're going to be scratching this person back forever, wondering when you're going to get your back scratched. You're going to turn around and look, and they're going to be fucking asleep. I'm going to be for real. You know it's just a little too late. Woo, there we go right now. Eight of Cups. Somebody's walking away from this family dynamic or from this man. Two of Pentacles. If somebody's walking away to balance their finances. September 2022. Somebody's walking away to balance out their finances. Okay. Yeah, somebody sees that they were being very childish at one point in time to keep up with the situation, okay? It just had them looking childish and immature, but now somebody is, like, trying to put the fight down, put their wands down and come to some type of um, sensible realization or resolution. That's week two. Week one, somebody's balancing the situation out. Week two, somebody is, like, really realizing that this was childish. I wasn't using my intuition. I need to stop fighting over this or for this. Week three, somebody is devastated. And they need to use their judgment when it comes to this situation. Because it just was a lot of things that was going on behind somebody's back. Okay? Somebody was acting like they did not see it. But with the moon being here, a full moon being here, it's being illuminated. All right? Page of Pentacles, Ten of Wands. Somebody is being burdened by the by the news or the message that they're getting in week four. Because I'm hearing they possibly already seen it coming. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. This situation is just not working out. So let's clarify this two of pentacles for my Aquariuses. What is this two of pentacles? What is this two of pentacles? I'm fucking hot. Strength, four of wands in reverse, and ace of pentacles in reverse. So somebody's trying to balance out their finances because why? They're trying to be strong, okay, and tame this inner beast in them that's making them want. Somebody may want to reach out, reach out. I meant to say leech out, but somebody may be wanting to reach out to somebody. Ooh, and then this hand is reaching out, but it's in reverse. But they know for a fact they can't reach out because whoever they want to reach out to, they scorn them or they like betrayed them. But somebody's having the courage and the strength to move forward, even though there is some instability in the foundation or a home and there was a missed opportunity. Somebody could have stole something or caused the missed opportunity i don't know somebody could have lost a lot of money money could be going bad there was something that was supposed to be starting new but it did not go but somebody is having to be very very strong okay because the situation will balance itself out but it's just like i'm feeling like somebody's getting hit with whatever this is at the wrong time somebody's already going through some things and then for this to come, somebody's like, wow, okay, well, I'm trying to balance out shit. I just lost out on all of this. How am I going to balance this out, okay? Whew. But be mindful, 222, two, two. if the energy has felt heavy, this could be a sign that things are about to lighten up. Sometimes we don't realize. Sometimes we go through loss and endings for a reason. So we got to shake that shit up. Sometimes we've been holding on for too much dead weight. This is a lot of de dead weight. This is what this is. Page of Swords. Somebody's stalking. Somebody's all in their head. They want to say something, but they don't have the right words to say. So they're just observing, taking notes. What is Two of Pentacles? Yeah. <laughs> I need to turn my air on. I'm acting like I don't got an AC. Why am I acting like that, y'all? way too gone what the mom thank you somebody was like under the influence when they did something or thinking about something six of wands in reverse see somebody's keeping this on the low that they are going through a bad karma okay not bad karma but just you ain't doing so well and it happens like that okay it happens like that i don't think a lot of people there's a lot of people that are doing well, but I feel like a lot of people right now are still, uh, they're feeling the effects of everything that's been going on COVID. I'm going to put it like that, COVID. Okay. I don't be liking to say that I say big C-boy, but um, 
it's been a lot that's been going on and somebody is like feeling the effects of it but they haven't been really showing it out in the public in the open with the six of wands in reverse for some of you guys the six of wands in reverse somebody feels like they missed this opportunity with you excuse me or whatever this is that they were supposed to be doing because they was worried too much about what the public was going to say or how the public was going to feel how the community was going to feel how other people were going to feel somebody was worried too much about the other people's opinions and views when it came to this situation and somebody could be seeing that in week one what's this page of cups in reverse and five of wands in reverse King of Wands in reverse and temperance. Okay, so somebody in week two seeing that they were very childish and they need to end this conflict and this competition. Somebody is seeing that they were being a cheater, they were being disloyal, they weren't being honest, they were being vengeful, they were had a lot of egotistic ways and they need to heal. Week two, somebody seeing that clear as day. What is this page of cups in reverse? Five of wands in reverse? Somebody could even could be mindful as well, you guys, To Somebody, um, make sure you go get a checkup, especially if you're pregnant, because somebody could, um, suffer a miscarriage in week two. For somebody, um, it could be stress-wise, anger-wise, or this could be sexually. Somebody not protecting themselves. So please be mindful of that and get a checkup, because when it's early and you catch something while you're pregnant, you can get that shit taken care of. But if you let it linger on, you know that can be very, very devastating to your child. Okay. I'm just told somebody needs to get a checkup. Um, if not, week one of um, September, week two for sure. See, because ten, then we then don't don't go waiting because sometimes when you go get a checkup and you get results, you might have to wait like a week or two. Okay. What's going on with this um, page of cups in reverse? Five of Wands in reverse. The hangman. So it's going to be some downtime. It's going to be some stagnation. But the lover, if somebody realizes that this is who they want to... It could be a Gemini in here. What the fuck? You guys, I'm not going... So who's stepping out? Or what's going on? Or is this something dealing with somebody being child? Okay, what's really going on? That's all I'm going to say. So somebody's going to be surrendering, trying to analyze this, this situation from a different perspective. Somebody had a hard time analyzing this situation from a different perspective at one point in time, but now somebody is seeing it. For whatever reason that this person wasn't analyze, analyzing this situation from a different perspective, now they are now they're seeing things differently now they're ready to take action now they're ready to be a leader because from whatever this is whatever perception that they was looking at this situation from at first it caused them to take a stand back and not really do much because possibly somebody could have possibly been perceiving somebody in the wrong view in the wrong light and now they have no option but to because look the hangman you upside down from a fucking tree it is the tree of life life has you hung up upside down from a tree so that you can analyze the reality of things from a different perspective right because whatever perspective that you was looking at it in it at one point in time it's just not the way that things were you were analyzing it from your own perspective not trying to see it from a bigger look at the bigger picture you know you gotta look at it from a different angle because it could you looking at me from this angle may look at look like one thing, but looking at me from the other angle, you may be seeing more of what's going on. And y'all get what I'm trying to say. That probably was a weak anal Y'all get what I'm trying to say. This is also like somebody needs to surrender to what is going on. Somebody wasn't surrendering to what was going on. They had it in their head that it was otherwise it was going on same thing somebody had to change their perspective on what's going somebody is realizing they need to change their perspective week two okay 24 minutes it's five <sighs> okay what's this ten of swords judgment five of cups in reverse see somebody is tired of crying they're done crying over spilled milk um, should I close my windows? I'm gonna close my windows. Give me one second.
So somebody is devastated in week three. Somebody needs to use their judgment. There was some type of betrayal. But with five of cups in reverse, this is saying that you need to leave it in the past. You need to stop crying over it. You need to stop revisiting, revisiting this situation emotionally. It's time for you to take your emotions out of this situation because it should be shown clear as day. Somebody is betraying you with this ten of swords. This person is not who they say they are. They're not. They not doing what they're saying that they're going to do. Ten of wands. See, this person is kind of burning. Something is stressful. It's a lot of work. Something is becoming to be very heavy and burdensome when it comes to somebody. The emperor. This could be a husband. This could be a father. But something is burdened. So, somebody's wanting to leave the past behind, but they're like having a hard time leaving it behind. It's like you're trying. Hmm. Some of you guys is this person that's having money issues, but they want to come in towards you. I didn't already say that, so let's just move on to week four. What's this Queen of Cups and Five of Swords in reverse? So somebody is stressed. Somebody's feels burdened about this message that is coming towards somebody. About this mother figure, about this wife. Somebody wants to bring something to some type of resolution. See, somebody at one point in time was for sure working, um, trying to win at all costs with this Five of Swords. But now with it being in reverse, it's like somebody's now seeing that they need to come to some type of resolution. Okay? And possibly heal themselves with this Queen of Cups. Because that could even be self-love, self-care. Somebody being very nurturing. Somebody needs to take the time out to nurture themselves. Or somebody sees now that they weren't so nurturing in the past. Okay, for some of you guys, somebody's been running over their own healing by, like, pointing a finger at everybody else. But they needed to heal something within themselves. See, this is this person as well, too. This person could have been, like, um... Because then I say stop demanding more, uh, more from others than you can... There's something that I don't know what the fuck I said. But somebody could have possibly been realizing that, damn, I was trying to demand all of this from these other people. that, And I can't even do it myself. I'm still trying to heal. I need to heal. Okay? I said it once. I'm going to say it again. Healing is not a one-step process. It's a forever thing. What is this Ten of Wands, Page of Pentacles? <laughs> That's why I hate when some people be like, no, we really healing over here. I'm actually healed. No, you're not. No, you're not. You think you are. The emperor. So somebody wants to take full control of this situation. They do. They want to man up. They want to be honest. The reason why I said what I said is because who are you to judge somebody in their healing process, right? So I'm just saying that. <laughs> For the people that judge other people, I will never go and tell somebody you're not healed based off of how I feel because I don't know if they're healed or not. Only thing I could say is to encourage them to do something. I can't be like, oh, you're not healed. You're not a healer. You're not healing. Okay, well, whatever. It is what it is. I'm going to call you a devil all day and every day. But I'm not about to, you know. I feel like nobody. This could, Okay, for me to be saying that. Because I don't even care about all that type of stuff. Not even like that. But for real, for real. This Somebody could be judging somebody. Like, oh, you're not healing. You're not a healer. You're not this and you're not that. And whoever this is, is not themselves. They need to actually go sit down and do some healing themselves. Right? But I feel like whoever this is, this other person is not even judging nobody either. This person is minding their business, but it's somebody else like that's all in the background like, Ah, you see me? You don't see me? You see what I'm doing? And somebody's like, you need to calm down. You need to focus on yourself, okay? Focus on you, and I'm going to do me. But they're all in your business trying to get a reaction out of you. Okay, it's because they need some help from you because they're going broke. Okay, they're gonna act like they need they they're gonna, somebody's about to act like that they're, they're they're gonna send you a helping hand, but it's not really help. Okay, it's it's attached to burdens and stress, and you already know that. 
Because you already exhausted from what this person has done in the past. Bye, bye, bye. Wow. You like, it's over and it's done. It's no more. What's going on? The Empress, period. I'm focused on myself, self healing, self care. You understand me? I am the Empress, and I see that now. I didn't see it in the beginning because I kept trying to give my love and my nourishing ways, ways, my nourishing love, because the, the self care, how can I say it? I was trying to nourish the wrong people and things but now i see what it is that i am and who i am i have plenty of opportunities that can come to me even if this does not work how it's not working i'm gonna have something else that comes to me male or female okay you don't always have to be a male with the emperor a female with the empress you have plenty of opportunities that come to you so even though this situation is not working out you got about 20 other situations that's going to work out it may not be 20 but it's, it's a few you may have three but it's not the end of the world. The sun, two of cups, it ain't the end of the world, child. I feel like some of you guys know it's not the end of the world. But it's just this person's energy that's having you make... They're trying to make you feel like it's the end of the world. And you know it's not. It's the end of their world. It's the end of you being in their world. But it's not the end of your world. You get what I'm saying? Even if it's like a job, career, or whatever this is. It's not the end. It's not the end and you know that and this person is having a hard time. This person is having a hard time accept the fact that you're accepting the fact that it's over more than they are. Or something of that nature. It's done. It's a new relationship that is coming towards you. It could be with a Leo. It don't have to be. But it's getting exposed that somebody's about to be in a happy little relationship. And it's about to be balanced. Equal give and take. Okay. Somebody else was being sneaky and deceptive, and that's why their ass is getting left out in the motherfucking code. Period. Point blank. Let's clarify the Empress. 32 minutes in. What's the Empress? Knight of Pentacles in reverse. The Empress and the Emperor in reverse. Yeah, this shit is done. The star. There you guys go again, right? Yeah, Aquarius. So you will be healing over this person's manipulation, their lies, their drama, their chaos. You already know there is nothing coming up out of this. Upright is already, it's, it's slow movement. You see the potential. You see the growth in this, okay? You see it. But in reverse, you don't see shit in this situation. It's done. It's done. There's no potential. There's no growth. There's no movement. Okay? You are the empress. They're the emperor in reverse. What can you do with that? For some of you guys, you feel like you're losing control and stability over your life. But you know you got plenty of opportunity that's coming to you. So you feel kind of stuck in a rut. Like, where do I go from here? For some of you guys, you're dealing with somebody that's abusive and controlling. Because they want to have you control, they want to control you because they know you always come up with something, you always make something out of nothing. So now this person is codependent on you and your energy and your opportunities and your success. Okay, you always make nothing out of something for them. Every time you down, who make it be right? You, you may be having a dollar in your hand, you turn that dollar into fifteen dollars. Fuck that, I, didn't I heard you turned that dollar into a hundred dollars, and they trying to figure out how. Because you're the empress. But in the midst of trying to figure out how, it's like some jealousy that it came up. Male or female. So don't take no empress and think I'm just talking to a female. I could be strongly talking to a male. Okay? They like, how are you? And there's plenty of females that's jealous of their, their, their mates. Plenty. People don't talk about that a lot, though. But they are. How you keep making it? How you keep getting it? You see, you could be somebody that's like, it's your money, so you manage it well. It's not like you're leaving this person out in the cold, but you're giving them enough to do what they gotta do you're not giving them over enough so they can be splurging and they don't like that they feel like you gotta give them all their money you don't gotta give that bitch shit excuse my language sorry you don't gotta give her nothing you really don't have to give them anything okay but y'all yeah, somebody's taking advantage of you i must just stop i don't wanna I, sometimes i'll be having it just you getting taken advantage of case closed close it out and go but i know y'all like to talk and y'all like to need to pull y'all be liking at me to go i was like that too keep talking Somebody getting taken advantage of and they see that, okay? Thing about to start lighting up now though. Because you're starting to realize I'm the fucking empress. Yeah. Yeah. I make this work. Again, even if you were male dealing with a female, you the one that's more loving, more stable, more you're the more nurturing one. You see that. This person just wants to control you and boss you around.
Edit found. Some of y'all know you gotta stop dealing with this man. You know you do. Some of you guys been dealing with this man since you was a child. Some of you guys, this is a family dynamic, and this could be your father, your uncle. It's a man or your father. You've been dealing with it with some dealing since you was a child. Some of you guys, something's going to come out that this person got some ways, and you know you got to let go of them. Somebody could even got coerced to deal with this person in their ways because of money. What's going on? Gee, Louise, why? Justice, home. So somebody, you may be getting an unexpected visit or a call to your house. Somebody may be gifting somebody a house. Child. What's going on? Didn't that motherfucking tell y'all to go to the fucking doctor? Excuse my language. Evidence. Get a checkup. Doctor. The moon. Don't be alone with them. Let me just show y'all. I'm about to close this out. Because I just told y'all. I just told my cards. I can't stop just yet because the cards is mixed up. So that means something. Um, don't be alone. Well, no, what they say. Moving on. Don't be alone with them. The secrets is out. Moon in reverse. We got doctor. Get a checkup. Evidence. You guys. Corroboration, healer, bad intentions. Blockages and disturbances. Ambition and time is now. Hater, friend, past lover, playboy, or playgirl. So somebody may strongly be getting some type of um, knowledge that, yes, your past lover for sure has bad intentions and possibly is a pedo. And you need to get a checkup, okay? And just protect yourself, okay? Protect yourself. This person could be using underage people to get make money off of, okay? Do you truly want to be in that environment? That's up to y'all. Y'all going to do what y'all want to do. But know that there is consequences. I'm not whoever. But just know that um, I don't condone that shit over here. But you know. Um, people do what they want to do all day and every day. I do. Y'all. Because I, I, I'm kind of scared that abuse. Yeah. Come on now. Abuse. Deception. Revise, rethink, reanalyze, watch them around your kids. Somebody needs to speak up and just stop. Let somebody know what's going on. This could be even a side piece. Stop ignoring the red flags. They're trying to harm you. I need you. Have the protection though. So somebody may be scared to speak up possibly because of how they're going to be perceived and how they're going to be looked as. Do not, do not, you may be saving a few lives. You don't know how blessed you will get by saving a life, okay? Okay? I love you guys so much. Take care.